Hello guys and welcome to another video. For those of you that are new here, my name is Andrea and you're more than welcome to stick around and check out some other videos. So I'm really excited for today's video because I will not only be unboxing an awesome punk rave outfit, but this will be the outfit that I will be wearing for probably day one or day two of Mera Luna Festival. We will be traveling to Germany on August 9th and I'm so excited. It's my first time at Mera Luna and apart from being like very happy about it, I'm also quite anxious. So if you guys have been there before, you know, some tips would be greatly appreciated. So just leave them in the comments below and let me know what I should be doing there, what I should look out for maybe. So who knows? I'm so excited! I have unboxed and reviewed Punk Rave items before, but this will be the first time that I will be reviewing Punk Rave accessories and I'm so excited because I haven't actually gotten anything accessory wise because they have a lot of stuff from like bags to like little gloves and I'm so excited to see what a Punk Rave accessory would look like. So yeah so this is the bag i went ahead and opened it up this is what it looks like on the inside and in here we have a dress a bag and a fan so as it usually happens with punk rave these items got here really quickly considering how much time it usually takes for items that are outside of eu to arrive this package got here in about 10 days since it shipped and that is not a lot at all i i don't actually remember if any punk rave item uh took more than 10 days to arrive and that's really awesome actually. If you do have delays with shipping or any type of issue, please don't hesitate to contact Punk Rave Australia because they're the sweetest people when it comes to helping you out with your order. They've been really helpful for me and I'm sure they will be helpful for you too. Okay, so before I open this package up, I'm going to show you what the items look like on Punk Rave Australia's website. So let's get started with the dress. This dress absolutely screams me. <laughs> The cutouts, the mesh, the lace detail, everything is so appealing to me. So I got the dress in a size FS, measuring myself and comparing my measurements to the global size chart. The global size chart can be found in the FAQ section of each and every item if you click on the where do I find your size chart question and access the link. So this is the global size chart and it's always been so helpful for me. I really suggest you have a look at it if you're not sure what size you should get. Let's move on to the bag. For the longest of time, I've been looking for a bag just like this one and could never seem to find one. And this looks so gorgeous. It's velvety, it's lacy, it looks so smally and cute and I cannot wait to open up the package and take it out and see what it actually looks like. And of course the bag is one size. Now, if we move on to the fan, I mean, just look at it. It looks like a freaking weapon or something. <laughs> it looks quite big in the pictures, so I'm not exactly sure regarding the actual size of it. I'm sure this will be very useful during the hot summer months, and not to mention something that I'd love to have around during a festival. So now let's move on to unboxing everything. And as you saw before, there's everything is bubble wrapped. So let me just take it out. Okay. I'll get my trusty scissors. I think I got it. I suck at this. So I managed to tear it up here and these are the usual punk rave bags. So I think this is the bag and the fan and yes and this is the dress it's quite heavy actually here we have our three items gonna pop. Ah! so here we have our three items and I don't know what I should start with, but I'm quite curious regarding the fan. So I think I'll start with this one because it's the smallest and it's so cute. So let's see. Oh, 
So this comes bubble wrapped too. And this is the tag over here. And oh no, scissors again. <laughs> okay, this is gonna take a while guys. So bear with me, please. Okay, I managed. I managed. Ow. I think I actually hurt my hand with the spikes. So this is wrapped one more time. Oh. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> the fan is really lightweight, but I can notice right off the bat that it's quite wobbly. And I believe that's due to the thin plastic. The rivets though are really awesome and it makes it truly unique. I've never seen a fan like this before. I mean, this will totally look badass, like look at it. I'm really sure that you cannot pass security at airports with this fan, but it's okay because I will put it in the big bag that goes below. So yeah, I think it's really nice. I cannot help but fan myself at the moment because it's really hot and there's no air conditioning on because you would hear it in the video. So I'm doing this for you guys. Something that I need to mention regarding the rivets, uh, the spikes, is that they're actually metal ones. So they're really high quality because I've seen some that are like really fake looking, but these are so badass. And also be careful not to take anyone's eye out when you fan yourself. <laughs> okay, so I move on to the bag because I want to leave the dress for last. So let's see what the bag looks like. I'm so happy. <laughs> oh my God, you guys. Just look at this. <laughs> I mean, I want to study it for a bit, just a second. Holy moly, this looks so awesome. It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful, you guys. So this bag is such a gorgeous piece and I'm so happy to own it. It's made out of this luxurious black velvet embellished with lots of lace details that resemble a flower in bloom. And the strap is made up of black pearls um, and it does feel quite comfortable to hold. I mean, I wouldn't mind holding it in my hand like so all day long because it feels very comfortable even though it's made out of these black pearls. I'm just gonna remove the tag so we can see what the bag looks like when it's all scrunched up. This is what it looks like on the inside. It's fairly big actually. I think you can fit a lot of stuff in here. I'm just trying to figure out how to close. Oh, okay, okay. On the sides, I'm gonna hold it <laughs> like this. So on the sides, it has these two bows over here and you pull them together like that. And that is how you close up the bag. And this is what it looks like when it's closed up. I really love it. Actually, I think I'm going to open these up and let them hang like so, maybe? I don't know. I cannot wait to hold this around at Mera Luna. It looks so nice. And I'm sure I can fit everything I need in here, like my phone, some earplugs, money, and so on. It's really nice. I love it. And last but not least, let's move on to the dress. I've been wanting to get this dress for a long time and oh, there we go. Ah, and I think this is a great time to have it and actually wear it as well. And let's take it out. Oh my God. <laughs> there we have it. So right off the bat, together with the tag, you get an extra button because it has buttons in the back. And I will just, I'll just cut out the tag for now so we can see, so we can see how beautiful this dress actually is. And oh my God, I'm gonna hold it up for you guys. Oh, wow. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. 
Look at the sleeves. Oh, wow. And the embellishment in the front, the mesh, oh my God. So the dress is made out of this stretchy fabric that looks like leather. The front of the dress is decorated with lace embroidery that resembles flowers, while the neck area is made up of this transparent mesh material and that continues all the way to the back where it closes up with little black buttons. The front of the dress featured two slits. You can see the slits right here in the front. And don't worry if you don't understand what's going on here because I know it's a lot of black and I'm just holding it up in front of the camera, but I will be inserting full body shots so you can see what it actually looks like when I wear it. And speaking of wearing, oh my God, I cannot wait to actually wear it. It's so beautiful, you guys. I get so excited about Pungrave clothing, but if you ever purchase something from Pungrave, I'm sure you get the same feeling because the clothing are full of details and they are so well made and yeah that's why I get so excited and giddy whenever I do these reviews. So that was it for opening the package up and reviewing the items. Now let's move on to those body shots. Okay guys, so that was it for today's video. If you liked it, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you like the sort of videos that I make. A big thank you goes out to Pongrave Australia for sending over these items. I really love them and I'm really excited to wear them at the Mera Luna Festival. By the way, let me know if you're going, if you'll be there. It would be wonderful to meet you guys there. And yeah, thank you for watching. See you all in my next video. Bye.